It is said that a woman's hair is her crowning glory, and hair manufacturers in Africa are capitalizing on the high demand. On average, women across the world will change their hair once or twice a year. But in Africa, women will change their hair once or twice a month. Now those odds are incentive enough for any hair manufacturer. Here in Kenya, the industry is worth about a quarter of a billion dollars. Godrej Consumer Products entered the Kenyan market seven years ago. It partnered with Darling, a popular synthetic hair extensions company, which has a presence in over 14 nations. Godrej, which owns a 51% stake in the manufacturer, says the investment is paying off. We just launched a new breed, which we're calling Elegant Breed. Um, this is actually a breed that is based on uh, one-year research and talking and working every day with consumers and stylists. And basically, it's from the consumer insight that every time they wear braids, they feel they're heavy and they pull on their hair and they destroy their hairlines. So what happens is that uh, when, you, when, you, when you wear, you know, you're trying to achieve volume, you, with time you have residing hairline. So this braid is made of a combination of lightweight fibers. Just last year, it spent about half a million dollars on research and development. The results led to Godred's latest product. The trends in Africa are led by the trends in the U.S. We are seeing a slowdown in the relaxer space, whereas a pickup in the natural space. Right. So depending on how the trend moves, the, the growth will vary for the range of products. What we are trying to do is not trying to predict the trend, but try to be, have a portfolio which will spread across all spaces. So whichever trend comes, we are able to leverage that. Kenya passed new tax regulations last year, including a 10% duty on cosmetics and beauty products. But it doesn't seem to have deterred entrepreneurs from venturing into the hair extension business. So when you have that natural hair and you can't comb it all the time, like right now it's very cold, anytime you blow dry your natural hair, it just shrinks back. So you see when you have natural hair and it's, the weather is rainy and cold, it, the best alternative is to have a weave on or to do your box braids. It's affordable and it's versatile. You can choose to have different looks, a look fancy, classy and sassy. Yeah, so it's... Just cool. According to a survey by Euromonitor, the market will continue to grow as young people become more aware of the importance of hair care, thanks to increased internet access, travel, and media influence. Alexandria Majala, Nairobi, Kenya.